So this is uh, a video about the pre-amplification and amplification of my home theater, um, starting at uh, the components in my rack. Uh, here what we have is the Moran's SR7012, which is um, running a 7.2.4 um, setup. Um, does get pretty warm. Uh, above that I've got the AC Infinity um, cooling fan, um, temperature regulated um, to keep it cool. And this is basically doing all the preamplification as well as I think two channels of the Atmos, uh, part of the dot four, um, two of the dot four channels of the Atmos speakers is running. Uh, beneath that, I've got the wire for sound MC7150. This is a 7 channel, 150 watt into 8 ohms. Um, it's pretty quiet and runs quite cool. I believe it's a class D amp. Um, so it does run quite cool, but I've got it because, you know, I want uh, proper power going through the surround channels as well as two of the Atmos. Um, that are being powered by the wire for sound MC750. And then beneath that, I've got the uh, amplification for the front stage. So this covers the front left, right, plus center stage. This is the Emotiva XPA3, um, pushing uh, 200 watt, I think, into 8 ohms. Um, there's some discrepancy in terms of the power it puts out. Some state um, 200 watt to 3 channels uh, and A ohms, and others are saying that they are pushing up to 275 watt into 3 channels, and that the 200 watt spec is when there are 7 channels. So that would be the XPA7. But regardless, it's over 200 at A ohms, which is plenty. Um, for the front center stage. Um, again, it, how much power you need to be dependent on what speakers you are running. So again, that's the um, that's the uh, pre-amplification as well as the amplification um, of my home theater setup. Um, the AC Infinity, I just want to talk a bit about the cooling. The cooling fan also has USB output so we can daisy chain and run additional fans off the same controller with the thermal or with the same thermal um, probe so what I have going is this is uh, temperature regulated or kick off there are three fans in this unit itself um, and then beneath that I've got two additional fans one for each of the amplifier cooling each and this all running off the same um, thermal probe so if it gets hot the fan will run across all three um, amp preamp. Um, so that's it.